Hey guys, it's me, Simming Nation, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Into The Future Part 6. So, in the last part, um, he just had work. Nothing much. But in this part, what we're gonna actually do, I, I said last part that we were going to go to the nuts and bolts bottom point, but I think we're gonna save that for next part, because we're gonna start talking to this Tina girl. So let's introduce ourselves. I bet, so. I bet she's married though, watch. She's gonna be married. Oh, and we had a home room last night. Discuss our favorite TV shows, Shaka Bra, talk about some movies, talk about the heat, even though know, it's probably like 70 mm -hmm. degrees out, 85. Uh, don't tell the story. Ibli, Ibli. Josh, do I get cooking, even though she probably used the synthesizer. Give her a high five. Zoom feed. We've got a fun feed too. Oh, mm. Okay, I don't know what time it's starting. Just like a minute ago, oh, I think. <laughs> okay, so I know what time we got to stop. So, speed three. We'll um, just chat with her and tell her dramatic story. Talk about the cosmos again. And then we'll be funny, we'll get you to sleep face, we'll tell a funny story, speak three. Um, then we'll be like, let's ask her sign, ask if she's single, compliment her appearance. Talk about her personality. That's the person. She's all good. She's a hopeless romantic. We can like steal her. Farzi! Oh, and she's single, so that's like perfect. So she's totally going for it. Let's give her some romantic red flowers. Because apparently we have those in our inventory along with the yellow flowers, which we'll sell in the accept them. Oh, we're totally friends, so we could start like hugging, flirtatious joke, uh, <laughs> flirt. Leave some movie. She's like a pink sim. She's a very sweet sim, I think. <laughs> Let's just go for the kiss. Good <laughs> Oh, and she totally took it. It's perfect. Now it's just like <laughs> kiss her. Okay. Mm. This house will Oh, because it's a community living center. Okay, makes sense. Back. Mm. 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 Mm-hmm. Let's do a dip kiss. This came with me mm. to the future. So they like spin the partner and then just kiss them. Oh, she's hugging on. She likes us. Or she means to wear an okay. <laughs> Can we ask to like go out with her? Propose to go steady if we can. We'll just embrace her. Vola. Even though we're extremely Azor. irresistible, we should be able to propose to go steady. <laughs> Whispering ear. Best watching one. Sleep will be sleep will be nice. creepy. Give her some Maybe more not. perfect purple flowers. Winga. Abby her. Flirt. Yes. Shy kiss. Um, can we do that in the future? Can you date that? I'm pretty sure you can. Hold hands. Uh, Compliment appearance. Ask to watch the stars. Why must oh, Let's not watch the stars since it's like wondering out. Hmm, that'd be quite weird. There's no stars to watch. 
Okay, we'll just talk to her another time. So we'll get back to her. Alright, and something I want to go do is explore with the nuts and bolts bot emporium. Because we're going to try and make a fun bot and then... Oh, glitch. Not with the ear thing. Maybe that was happening. This is like the weather outside right now. Kind of, not really. It's not lightning and thunder. Alright. So what you can do is go downstairs. Is that all they have is all the muffins? Yeah. Let me guess. The blue one is the boys. Yeah. Oh, I'll can use that. Because I don't, you don't need hygiene. It didn't take too long. So this is the bot building machine. At first you can only design plumb bots. And just create is it a plumb bot. I believe you need to be skill level 2. So really all you can do at first with no skill level in bot building is design damage. So he touches a little hover screen. Pretty cool. 3D holographic objects. Alright, and now once you can grasp the basics, I'll read this. A bot builder is a tinker at heart who's capable of building everything from simple mechanical nanites into complex sim like bot, plumb bots. It'll take time to practice in practice before Mark is ready to build advanced plumb bots, but even a novice can design or create treat chips or any nanites to get started. So we're not going to design nanites the whole time. We'll design some treat chips as well, which is basically the same process I used to design a couple of nanites. This is a really loud one. So you know how to build Okay. He's already pot building level two. Congratulations, Mark has improved his pot building skill to level two. Mark can now build plumb bots. These robotic companions are just like a member of your family, only shinier. Installing trade chips will help the plumb bots develop their personality and skills and unique abilities. <laughs> Alright, so we're not gonna build a plumb bot until I think we're skill level three, otherwise they come out pretty poopy. Save the nice display. So we'll just create a chip. Crate chip. Actually, I believe we need some nanites. So we'll get the left arm, the scaler, the Heisenberg. Get those nanites. Then we'll create a cheat chip. So it's just like zaps them together. And boom, there you go, it's a nanite. Is he level 3? No. No, yeah, yes. <laughs> Created the scaler. And. Alright, and we will create the handy bot. Now it's just the same little process, but when it finishes, you get the little trade chip. Alright, now something that you should do, um, if you want, you can reverse engineer these to get um, these blank processors, but if you don't want to do that, you just want to get them really quickly, you can head over to the register and just pick a couple up. So we'll just, um, I don't think we need, we'll get one medium for now. And I think we'll get a sentience to put in our first plumb bot. But it's a lot of money. So, I'm going to end this part here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, there will be another part, basically, right after this. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Have a great day, and I will talk to you guys in part 7. Have a great day, guys. Bye.